Hey guys, welcome back for another video. Today we are going to look at how to clean mold off of your windows. So as you can see, the window in front of me is severely affected by mold and we are going to clean all of it off today. First thing you want to do is uh, just to familiarize yourself with the area that you want to clean. And before you clean, you want to check for which area is most affected and make sure there is no leakage or seepage in the window in that location. Now the best time to do that is before you clean so that you can see the affected areas and make sure that it does not recur because of seepage or leakage that's happening. So that helps identify the underlying cause and um, make a permanent fix to the problem. So once you've identified uh, the affected areas and made sure there's no leakage or seepage, the next step is to uh, find out what you need to use in order to clean this mold and I'm going to show you the equipment that I'm going to be using today. So the equipment that I'm going to be using today is a simple mold removal solution that I bought from Walmart. Uh, it's called Tylex. I don't have any preference for this brand. I just searched it online and I found some good reviews for this one. So I decided to go for this one. I have a face mask, some gloves, a cleaning sponge and some paper towels. I always use a face mask and a glove for any kind of uh, cleaning job that I'm doing just to make sure my skin and uh, um, my face is protected and you don't breathe in any of the harmful chemicals. So that's a good practice to follow. Once you've identified what you want to use, uh, the next step is to make sure you've read the instructions for whatever you buy. Uh, make sure you've uh, referred to any safety and precautions, uh, anything that is recommended by the manufacturer. Go through the instructions, make sure you've read them in detail and you're prepared from step one to the last step of the instructions before you start. Now the instructions with this one are very simple. You simply spray it on over the affected area, give it a few minutes till it starts coming off and then keep wiping it. So we're going to get started with that process and in our case since there's heavy growth of mold it might take a few attempts uh, to clean it up completely and it may not get done in the very first attempt. So let's get started. Alright guys, so I'm going to spray over the entire affected area and I'm going to hold it a little bit far and not touch it completely and I'm going to tilt it a little bit angling towards the affected area and I'm going to start spraying. I'm going to spray a nice even layer. For me I'm going to apply a lot of it because the growth is significant. In your specific case, depending on how much mold growth you have, you may only need a single light coat of it. In my case, I think I'm going to need multiple attempts. Alright, I'm going to give it a couple of minutes now for it to start um, taking its effect. And once I see it coming off, I'm going to start wiping it down. All right, guys, I gave it uh, only about uh, about 40 to 50 seconds and you can see already so much of it has come off on its own. I have not even wiped it with a sponge and it's just started coming off on its own. So now I'm going to start wiping it and you're going to see the difference uh, almost immediately. I'm going to go with the top first. And you can see how much has come off. That's the amount of mold that was there on there. Uh, let's do the base. Look at that. Tremendous. Now this area, the black line here, it's going to take more than one attempt, but the top layer of it has started coming off. Wipe the base. And you can go and wash the sponge, <clears throat> rinse it a little bit and then come back 
and continue on the process so I'm gonna go and rinse it and come back Right, so you just gotta keep repeating the steps, keep rinsing the sponge and keep wiping the area over which you spray. And wait for it to dry up before reapplying a coat and start with the rest of the area up top. And once the area that you first cleaned is a little bit dried up, you can reapply the solution to it and start cleaning again. So you can right away see how clean it is compared to where we started off from and all the mold that was here is all gone. So that's how easy it is and it's an effective way to keep your windows clean and uh, keep the mold from regrowing. Um, very simple to do, takes only a few minutes and um, it's always good to keep your house free of mold. You can follow similar steps even in your bathroom area and the sink area if you have mold growth there. And overall, uh, this has been a very effective uh, solution that I used, Tylex. It's my first time using it and I'm pretty satisfied overall with the results. Um, your questions, comments and feedback are always welcome. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you for watching.